Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and today we'll be looking at some of the best tools to make some amazing mockups from your user interface design or any other design for that matter. So the first mockup is mockup frames. And this is a cool uh, mock-up tool, uh, specially designed towards creating some awesome dribble and Instagram shots. So all you need to do is select a video or a photo. So you can select any one of these. Uh, I'll quickly go ahead and select a video uh, since we can do that. And um, as you can see, we can create uh, with the iPhone 10 uh, in mind. Uh, we can change the perspective easily. And once we're happy with the perspective, all we need to do is either and just export it as a GIF in 60 frames a second. Uh, we can flip it. You can activate anti-aliasing as well. And also you can decide which platform you want to export for. So for Instagram, it'll export as a thousand by thousand. Dribble, it'll export as 800 by 600 for GIFs. And, uh, or you can even set a custom width and height. And you can change the color of the device based on the kind of device you have. Uh, even clay models are there, just like this. And you can change the color of the background, uh, give these complex gradients in the background. So there's a pretty cool tool. And you can even do this for Android devices like this one, like the Samsung or PC or web, uh, just like that. And it has a lot of options and you can export as an MOV, MP4, PNG, or even a GIF. I'll put all these links down in the description so you can check them out. Okay, so the next tool that we're gonna take a look at is called Screen Space Studio. Uh, now there are other options that you have, but Studio is what provides the same similar features uh, that you get um, in the 3D camera or Rotato as, as they call it. And Rotato is a cr crazy good tool for creating 3D animation mockups, but it's only available for Mac. So this one especially is to use with uh, your web. So this is all on the internet. You don't have to get out of the browser. You don't even have to download any application. Once you have a trial account set up, a free account, uh, go to say create new scene and um, it'll create a new scene for you and it'll open up here and it, it'll show you how to use this so you don't even have to worry about it. So we have the iPhone XS, uh, I'll select the iPhone XS, right? I'll press enter on it and uh, in a few seconds it'll just load it up and there you go, there's your device. And uh, now we have to do is insert the actual screen in here. So I've already uh, prepared something or I can just upload a screen uh, depending on what I like. But you know, I have something already here. So I'll put it in this. It might take a couple of seconds to load. It says use Chrome for better performance. That's you know up to you. So I have the iPhone 10 right here and I can either flip it like this or spin it like this or change the orientation just like this. And the best part is you can even animate this. So uh, for instance, I want to animate this. How do I animate this? You can uh, either choose from a bunch of presets or you can try and learn this software and check it out how to use it. So I'm gonna use this preset five, which is pretty cool. And uh, if I press play, it should play it for us. Isn't this pretty cool? This is, this is very similar to Rotato or 3D Camera and uh, it's available for your browser. So you don't even have to download a separate app for this. Just remember, try to use Chrome. I'm using Firefox, but it works pretty okay with it. And I can zoom in, zoom out, and create my own animations here, just like you do in your After Effects. So there we have this, and this is a pretty cool soft. Uh, this is a pretty cool tool, it's free of cost. You can upgrade to, to have more artboards, more plans, cloud rendering, real-time editing, 4K resolution. So this is slightly expensive, but I've gone for the free one, which is pretty in, good enough for me. Once you're done with this, you just have to say render video or render image. For example, if I want to say render image or render video, I say render video. You have a free plan that can only render five second 
samples upgrade to render so five seconds is good enough if you want to show a small animation so i'll go ahead and say record five seconds your render is submitting your render is currently in queue and it tells you where your render has reached and the best part of this website is once it started the rendering you can actually exit this website and uh, you don't even have to worry about it once you've exited the website after some time you go back so if i say screen space and i go back and log into the website launch site and um so once I log in, I can open this because it's already saved this for us. And um, you know, you can check how much your render has been done from here. Once it's rendered, it'll be available for download and you can download it onto your system as an MP4. How cool is that? Okay, another cool website, again, you don't have to have a software for this, is Threed.io. It's still in beta, so cut it some slack. Uh, it's not perfect, but it's pretty good. So if I start the generator, it allows me to, again, create 3D static mockups. Again, if you want a static mockup for Dribbble or any other platform, go ahead and you can even apply random colors to it, uh, whatever you like, a hex code is done. Um, and you can upload an image. Here, there is no support for GIFs or MP4s to my knowledge. So it's best that you stick with its whatever is defined and you can change its uh, rotation, you can change the angle. So if, if you want, you can change it by just dragging around the screen just like this. Uh, let me bring it back. Yeah, I can change the shadow, whether I want a shadow or whether I don't. I can change the color of the device and I can even change whether the device should have like a, a light glare or not. So that is pretty cool. And once it's done, you just click on download and it goes straight to download. No questions asked. Uh, completely free of costs. There are no hidden charges. And it's pretty cool if you want a quick tool to create 3D mockups for your designs. Okay, another software that I like to introduce to you is Hammock. And Hammock is a great tool if uh, for presentation. So if you want to create a slide for your presentations, or if you just want a uh, you know, a, just a random GIF playing inside these complex mockups. It could be this device. It could be uh, a hand. Again, none of these softwares have sponsored me. So this is a unbiased uh, kind of reaction to these tools. And as you can see, there's a lot of options, a lot of devices. And again, uh, it's free of cost. There are no hidden charges, hopefully. And um, as you can see, there are a lot of examples you can see for all your devices. And there's a whole explanation video or tutorial right here on the website. So that's pretty neat. Uh, so you know how to use it before you use it. And it's a pretty cool, uh, and it's a pretty cool free tool for you guys to use. Okay, so those were the top free tools and I post free videos every Monday and every Thursday. So go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Also press that bell icon because the bell icon will help our channel grow. This is not just my channel, this is our channel. Uh, I hope you guys have an amazing day and God bless.